Good Wednesday evening, folks, or afternoon, I should say. It's uh, currently exactly noonish. It is Wednesday, the 23rd. It is 39 degrees out here, and you guys won't believe what I uh, woke up to this morning. Get you guys turned around here in just a brief moment. Sorry for the squinting. I just woke up a little bit ago, and I have not quite adjusted yet to the sunlight. But uh, yeah, let me get you flipped around. I woke up this morning to this snow on everything again you can see my neighbor's roof is covered in snow 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 not a lot of snow mind you maybe about an inch inch and a half but most of it's probably already melted so it might have been a little more than two inches of snow who knows but uh, yeah, just figured I'd give you a little bit of an update as to what the heck happened. I was not expecting this. It's been uh, absolute garbage weather for the last three days. Nothing but rain and clouds and icky. But uh, yeah, I got a little bit of uh, cloud sporadicism everywhere. Got some clouds over that way. Clouds over there. A little breezy out here today so this will hopefully blow out today and it'll be all nice and sunny the rest of the day so I would like to actually get some work done on my day off while I have the day off but uh, yeah aside from that my uh, tarp over here is collecting a puddle my other tarp over here is collecting a puddle all of my plants have been completely watered at this point I mean by the time this stuff melts I'll probably have about standing water in the basin of all of these black tarp over there has got holes in it I popped a whole bunch of holes in that one just to uh, let the water perf uh, permeate through and get into the soil so my soil doesn't dry out but yeah figured I would uh, give you guys an odd little update and a little update this is because I doubt I'm gonna make it to five minutes because there ain't really much else to do uh, at this point other than maybe take a peek in the greenhouse which I don't know if it'll actually show up on camera. I can't see because the sun's behind me. But uh, yeah, the uh, inside of this thing looks like a freaking sauna. And it's about 80 degrees in here according to my thermometer inside. But, yep. Kana's doing well. This guy is going absolutely nuts. I've been picking off all the dead flowers. But check it out, I've got, I don't know if you guys can see this, I can barely even see this on my screen. I got a brand new plant right there coming up. I got another three, let's see if I can get them in there. There's one right there on that edge, and there's two more under the leaves. But yeah, this thing is going to be taken off soon, and it's going to be this whole pot is going to be nothing but these plants, or this flower. Which this thing is, since it started, it is just going absolutely nuts. It's getting all my bugs though, which is kind of funny. I keep looking at here and I keep finding bugs stuck to the plant. Like everywhere, little bugs. So, it's good to have this plant, I guess. It's keeping most of my bugs at bay. And then my, uh... My little guys down here aren't really doing much. I got one onion popped up over there, and then I think I've got another one's popping up over here somewhere. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to redo these ones. These ones aren't working out the way I wanted them to. But I did transplant my jalapenos. Just giving these guys, uh, every once in a while I come out here and I whack them. This guy's going to be an absolutely stout, beastly plant. That thing is thick. Got to come in here and water these guys again so they don't dry out. But yeah, other than that, um, don't really have much information or updates on the way of everything in here. It's just the greenhouse as is. You guys have seen it. Some of y'all love it. Some of y'all hate it. But uh, yeah. Thank you guys thus far for sticking with me. Again, following up me through all my shenanigans, non-shenanigans, my failures and all that wonderful jazz and all my wonderful successes which greenhouse helps but uh, yeah don't forget to hit that thumbs up subscribe if you haven't hit that bell icon so you get notified when i put out new videos share it out with friends family young container gardeners beginning gardeners 
send them my way, I can help them out. Maybe I can get some advice from them as well. You never know. But uh, this is going to be Fox It Outdoors signing off. Y'all have a wonderful day.